Undoubtedly, Kling AI is one of the best AI video generators at this moment. Day by day, it's upgrading its capabilities to become superior. On December 18th, Kling AI dropped another bombshell, Kling AI V1.6. This new version is capable of generating more consistent and dynamic results by greatly improving your prompts. Today, we are going to try this new video generator model and prompt guide to generate the best results. So, let's dive in. This is the Kling AI homepage. If you are new to Kling AI, you have to create an account. Kling will provide a free 366 credit trial run. Once you are logged in, your interface will look like this. To access the video generator, click on AI video from here. Okay, this is the video generator interface. On the top left side of the page, you can access the Kling video generation model. Let's select Kling 1.6 from here. If you want to use the text to video tool, select the text to video option. And if you want to turn your image into a video, select the image to video option. This is the text to video prompt box. Here, describe your creative ideas. For example, I am typing, a Santa giving gifts to some children. It's a very basic prompt. Let's see how Kling 1.6 deals with this kind of simple or poor prompt. After entering the prompt, go to settings. First, you will find the creativity level here. If you slide this level to the left, the video will be more creative. And if you slide it to the right, it will follow the prompt more closely. I will keep it at a moderate value. The next option is mode. You will find standard and professional modes. The professional mode can generate superior quality videos, but costs more credits and takes a longer time. After the quality setting, you will find the video duration. In professional mode, you can generate videos up to 10 seconds long. Let's generate a 10 second video. Next, set the aspect ratio. Here, you can generate videos in landscape, portrait, or square ratios. I will go with landscape. After the aspect ratio, you can select the number of videos. In Kling AI, you can generate a maximum of four videos at a time. Only Kling AI offers you this feature. Even further, we have camera controls, but the Kling 1.6 model doesn't support this feature. So, we have to skip it. Kling 1.6 model introduces another interesting feature. Negative prompts. Enter what you don't want in your video. Once done, hit the generate button. As it will take some time, I will fast forward this part. And here it is. The video is ready. Look at the quality. It's just amazing. Can you believe that it's not real and is made by AI? There is not a single instance of morphing, unusual movement, or unnatural objects. Now look at the quality of the video generated by the same prompt using Kling 1.5 and Kling 1.0. The difference is clearly visible. So now, you can create amazing, consistent, and dynamic videos with a very simple prompt using Kling 1.6. All right, now I'm talking about another very important update of Kling 1.6. You can actually create amazing camera shots using this model. While you can't directly access camera movement, you can do so with the prompt. So, let's talk about the prompt. According to Kling AI, you need to follow some basic rules when writing a prompt. Your prompt should be structured as follows. Subject plus subject, movement plus scene, plus camera, plus lighting, plus atmosphere. Try to write your prompt using this formula. I have written some prompts using this method. Now I am going to try one of them. After entering the prompt, set all the settings and then hit the generate button. And here it is. The video is ready. Look at the result. It's just amazing. I love it. It's a perfect tracking shot example. Using the same method, you can generate any kind of scene with any kind of camera work. For example, here is a dolly zoom. Kling 1.6 perfectly portrayed the shot and produced a perfect scene. Not only cinematic scenes, but you can also create dynamic animation clips. For example, I am entering a prompt about a 3D character walking on the ground with a dog. After entering the prompt, set all the settings and then hit the generate button. And here is the resulting video. You can see the result. Can you imagine this amazing video clip was generated by AI? It looks like it was created in a professional studio. 
As of now, Kling AI supports the lip sync feature, so you can create a full-fledged AI 3D movie using the Kling AI video generator. If you want to know how you can do it, let me know in the comment section. I will make a detailed video. All right, this was the text to video generator. Now, let's move forward to the image to video generator. Click on the image to video tab from here. Now you will find the option to upload images. Click here and upload the image. Once the image is uploaded, you will find the option to add the end frame. At this moment, Kling 1.6 doesn't support the end frame option. You have to select Kling 1.5 or 1.0 to enable this feature. Let's see how it generates with the latest model. After uploading the image, you can add an additional prompt or skip it. My suggestion is to add a detailed prompt to get a better result. So, add a detailed prompt here. Next, adjust the motion brush, creativity, mode, duration, and generation count settings. Set all the settings according to your needs. Once all the settings are done, hit the generate button and wait a moment. And here is the resulting video. It's just amazing. It looks like a cinematic shot. Now let's try without any prompt. I am uploading the same image, removing the prompt, and then hitting the generate button without making any other changes. This is the video generated by Kling 1.6. This result is also very good. I love it. So, Kling 1.6 can generate outstanding results even without a prompt. Okay, here is another video I generated with Kling 1.6. Look at the video quality and camera work. Kling did a great job. So, we can easily say that, at this moment, Kling 1.6 is one of the best AI video generator models available. If you are looking for the best video generator AI, don't forget to try this tool. The link will be in the description. Alright friends, I will wrap up our video now. Before that, I would love to hear your opinions about the Kling AI video generator. Share your thoughts and results in the comment section below. Don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful, and subscribe to our channel for more amazing tutorials like this one. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, happy creating.